Guys, Cap here. I wanted to teach you some sea shanties. There's going to be a picture of a boat um, with all the different parts of a boat on it. That's going to come up when we're doing our close reading in this unit, the Lord of the Flies unit. But I do want to teach you a couple of sea shanties. So, these are call and responses. So, um, yeah. I'll see you here in class and virtually, but thank you. I'm assuming you're going to be singing along while you're listening. Now, these are as I was taught them. Um, and there's two. I might be adding more to these as I go. But here we go. This is called South Australia. And your line is, we're bound for South Australia. That was beautiful, I'm assuming. We're bound for South Australia. Okay. And then you've got, heave away, haul away. Heave away, haul away. Okay. So I'll point to you when it's your turn. You'll notice that it's going to have an awkward lag, but I'm assuming you are singing along at home, students in Miss Cav's English 9 classes. All right, here we go. South Australia, I am bound. <laughs> South Australia, dad. Oh, no. I forgot my lines. Okay. South Australia, I am bound. Heave away, haul away. South Australia, da da da. We're bound for South Australia. Haul away, you rolling kings. Heave away, haul away. Haul away, you'll hear me sing. We're bound for South Australia. As I go around Cape Horn, heave away, haul away. I wish to God I'd never been born. We're bound for South Australia. Haul away, you rolling kings. Heave away, haul away. Haul away, you'll hear me sing. We're bound for South Australia. Australia. I wish I was on my native land. Heave away, haul away, a glass of water in my hand. You're bound for South Australia. Haul away, you rolling kings. Heave away, haul away, haul away. You'll hear me sing. We're bound for South Australia. Haul away, you rolling kings. Heave away, haul away, haul away. You'll hear me sing. We're bound for South Australia. To my fellowship friends, if you've noticed that I've cut out a couple verses, I teach high schoolers. Also, fellowship friends, if you have any suggestions for songs that are appropriate to sing to 14-year-olds in a public school setting, leave them in the comments down below. Thanks, guys.